Security hearing a first degree murder case. News Watch Exceed's Kathy Gullick was in Carbon County Court today to tell us about that trial of a woman charged with killing her husband. Bonnie Lefton of Lower Palamensing Township admits she shot and killed her husband. Her defense attorneys are trying to convince the eight woman, four man jury that she killed her husband, Alfred, last year in self defense. And they're saying she suffered from battered spouse syndrome. Psychologist for the defense, Dr. Robert Gordon of Allentown, testified that Bonnie Lufkin was abused by her husband for 15 years. And he testified, as many abuse victims do, she tried to hide it, tried to deny it, and felt that there was no escape from it. There's usually actual threats that if the spouse leaves, that they'll be murdered. And case studies show that they have good reason to believe that when that often happens. The batterer needs a scapegoat. Usually these aren't successful men. They have a hard time making it financially, emotionally, and they need a ready scapegoat. So if the scapegoat leaves, they feel very threatened. Dr. Gordon says many such cases end in a homicide suicide. Battered abuse syndrome is a controversial murder defense in Pennsylvania. It hasn't yet faced a court test. But if it's successful in this case, the defense says it may help all battered spouses. Obviously, we don't want this to be seen as a sign that women can go out and shoot their husbands. And, you know, I would certainly hope nobody sees it that way, and I don't think women would see it that way. Uh, but I think for women in a similar situation, just publicizing the problem will make them realize that there are, are alternatives and try, have them try to get some help. I'm told that attorneys and psychologists across the state are watching for the outcome of this trial to see whether battered spouse syndrome will be successful as a defense in the state's court. Kathy Bellish, Newswatch 16, Jim Thorpe. Her Bonnie Leskin are saying she shot her husband to death in self-defense. The lower Calamansing Township woman admits she killed Alfred Leskin last year, but also says she suffered from battered spouse syndrome brought on by 15 years of physical abuse from her husband. Pennsylvania attorneys and psychologists are watching this trial as it's the first use of the battered spouse syndrome as a murder defense in the state or county court. The jury will get final instructions from the trial judge tomorrow in the Carbon County trial. The Muncie High School is considered a victory for battered wives everywhere. A jury this afternoon found a Carbon County woman not guilty of murdering her husband. Bonnie Lefkin of Lower Talmanson Township had admitted she killed her husband but said she did it to protect herself. As Newswatch 16's Dan Fiorucci reports, the jury agreed that as an abused wife, Leskin had no choice.